Um, oh, check this out. Let's go. Oh, what did I tell you guys? Hello, the troopers. We are here at Ross. Uh, this is a Ross I have not been to, I think. Uh, this is off of Commerce Street. I'm actually not even sure where we are. But um, I saw it on the map and I was like, hey, why not stop by and check out what they got? Let's see it. Okay, so right here at the beginning of the store, right at the entrance, we got um, a lot of Funko Pops, some anime figs. We got, let's see, on this side, we got a little bit of lightsabers already. All right, not quite the ones we're looking for, but still pretty good to see. Over here, we do have some Micro Galaxy Squadron, got Book of Boba Fett, Retros, Micro Galaxy Squadron. No, oh, look, ah, we still got a. $3.99 Vince collection out on the floor. Let's put that back up. Um, let's see over on this side. We got some tables already set up. And it looks like we got the Riddler coming in here. We got some more DC on this side. Ooh, Blue Beetle. Alright. Battle mode for five bucks. Another Blue Beetle. Also five bucks. And then we got Arkham Knight for six bucks all right pretty cool gaming greats uh the umbra arc trooper so yeah ross is definitely kicking it into high gear guys let's check out what they got at the actual toy section all right check it out this ross has a lot of toys guys look at all of that kind of crazy right so let's dive right in um let's see what do we see on this side we see some more dc multiverse we got an army of arkham knights for six bucks these are all arkham knights actually few riddlers back then for six bucks also kind of crazy out here we got some more uh, pink toys we got some barbie stuff very cool check it out man we got a lot going on so um let's see we got some cars we do have some plushies we got some bakugan of course for all my bakugan enthusiasts we got some street fighters oh i like this maza and chun li and we got the stingray with cami very cool of course young jedi adventures have to have it nobody wants it but it's gotta be there right uh, i see some more back there we do have some power rangers merch in the house very very cool a lot of play-doh let's see what else we got down here mm, got some pokemon we have some dinos down there we got some cooking sets uh oh check this out got the redeemer for five bucks no way i think i have this one but man five bucks i always like this character quite a bit i'll think about this one might be a cool piece to display uh, out here we got some more barbie we got some miniverse giant packs out there and over here looks like we got some cars we got some um oh look at that stitch right ons very cool um, we got some mini transformers over here on the side micro machines pretty cool we got some more stitch here we got some bluey from my bluey and bingo fans right there mm, we do have transformers cheat war very nice and then we have some more micro machines for transformers those are cool I like those oh task force plays it very nice so yeah guys we've definitely got quite a bit going on now uh, we got some rc's we got some x shots right there we got a big pack of vehicles over here oh we got some transformers tracks what is this it's kind of cool i don't think i've seen this before uh, we got some mickey of course uh some frozen back there some more x shot and let me get around to that side there's still more Okay, a little bit of uh, Avatar. We got Azula from Diamond Select. We got TMNT stuff back here. We got some Fisher Price Batman trailer. That's kind of cool with some cars. Um, we got a little bit more Hot Wheels back here as well. And we got some SpongeBob, of course. Cannot, cannot miss the SpongeBob. Uh, but yeah, let's go now into the regular toy aisle. Got a pretty cool 13 piece Lilo and Stitch figures. Uh, this might become popular with the new movie coming out what do you guys think okay so coming to uh what seems to be somewhat of the remains of the regular toy aisle so we do have the mando 549 i could have sworn those were a little bit cheaper we got some more micro machines 
my um, from Transformers. We got some Byakugan in the house and got some snake eyes. Uh, Tower of Hell. That's uh, okay. That's that. Some clearance. Oh man. Some clearance. Um, Young Jedi Adventures, of course. Again, nobody really wants them. That's a black series for 13 bucks, man. Learning some more Young Jedi Adventures. Kai Brightstar and his speeder. Um, oh, check this out. Let's go. Oh, what did I tell you guys? Remember the previous toy hunt? I told you I didn't pick this up at Target for regular price. Well, here it is for six bucks. So, this I will pick up. Thank you very much. Um, man, this thing is chunky. All right, so we got got a snow speeder also. We got the N1. We got another Jawa crawler, snow speeder, and another N1. Man, this is crazy. We literally just saw this like five days ago at Target for full price. We got some Pokemon down here. We got some more Blue Beetle. We got some Naruto. We got some Page Punchers in the house. All right, interesting, interesting. Got some minifix for Spider Man. And uh, I think that is about it on this side. Let's jump over to the next aisle. Okay, so this seems to be, again, what is left over of the regular aisle. Um, I still see a couple things. So we got a Sunman. Pretty beat up though, but four bucks, not bad. Um, what else? Let's see. We got some Eleven from Stranger Things. We got some more Hot Wheels. It looks like another Snow Speeder times two. Definitely some more Young Jedi Adventures, uh, some TMNT, looks like some sort of track. Mm, we got some Micro Galaxy Squadron, which will always be here. Uh, plenty of stuff on the top. Let me know if you guys see anything that, you know, is worth it up there. Coming back down here, we got some Super Mario figures for eight bucks. We got some Transformers for eight bucks back there. Some surprise eggs some um hot wheels as well mm, let's see what else have we got we got some glow in the dark um slime uh we got some anime figs over here we got some more stranger things we got some rc cars back there some tmnt here Star Wars Micro Galaxy Squadron. This looks to be the Imperial Troop Transport for 13 bucks still. I feel that that should have gone on clearance already. Uh, we got some Naruto running. Famous run right there. Uh, let's see if we got anything different down here. Some more Micro Galaxy Squadron. Another Naruto. Some more Jedi Adventures. Not really seeing anything standing out anymore. Uh, let's see down there. No. It's kind of funny how the regular uh, toy owl is kind of not uh, very stocked, right? These are cool evolution packs for TMNT. 10 bucks, it's not too bad. Um, oh, we do have a little lightsaber. Kind of nice to see. Uh, let's see, on top here, we got something for the Mandalorian, which is that blaster. And we got, oh, we got some best action Casey Jones. Urban Legends. I thought that was an exclusive. Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments. And some more Casey Jones as well. All right, so definitely finding stuff. And then on this side, well, this seems to be more of the girl section or girl-oriented section. We do have a Micro Galaxy Squadron TIE Fighter down there, but nothing that interests us here. All right, this is a score though. Okay, so I was walking out. I think they put putting up more stuff because I did not see this Nightwing. And we just went through this section. So, yeah. Always keep checking your routes, guys. There's quite a bit out there. Man, to Al jumping into the Transformer section. Um, do you guys see anything new, really? Not, not too sure anymore. Mm, but if anybody in the comments knows Transformers, I would really appreciate some feedback on it. Um, let's see. Jumping into DC, we got Commander Steel. Oh, check this out. We got Jada Optimus Prime. I would love if this thing would transform. That would be pretty cool. Um, let's see. We got Aquaman from Digitals. We got Fire back there. We got Joker as Batman Gold Label. We got Metallo as well. We got them big figs, of course. We got the Ecto 1. We got a 25% off coupon. It's interesting. Uh, so we got 
Uh, Joker and Punchline 2 pack. Let's see, what else do we got? I feel like we've seen all this before. Um, we got Doc. Have we seen Doc before? I don't think so. Another 2 pack right there. And another Doc. Alright. Simpsons. I guess the line is kind of popular, right? I mean, there's always seems to be not that much um, Simpsons merch. Uh, Marvel Legends, again with the Marvel Studio Wave. Really nothing new. Got the family again. Might have to pick that up as a uh, Christmas present, actually. Uh, let's see, down here we got that Kryptonite Doomsday. Oh, we got Dark Side. See this thing? That's kind of cool. I don't know that we've seen that one. Um, let's see. Oh, we got a cool Spidey. It's just the McFarlane. The webs look kind of cool, actually. Translucent effect. Those are nice. Not too bad. Um, nothing else when it comes to Marvel, though. Yeah, really, really scary stuff. We got Gojitsus for Marvel as well. Um, nothing that really stands out as new. We still have the Animal Planet collection here. We got Valley of Dinos up there. Akito Beyblade. Mm, I think this is new for Akito too. Uh, so yeah, that's gonna do it for this side of the album. All right, jumping into the Dino section. Um, Chaos Theory, again, dominating as usual. Let's start learning this stuff, by the way. There's been a couple of comments. Uh, in my past videos that we've seen some uh, weird, or not weird, sorry, some like rarer stuff, and I just don't know how to identify it. But I did just notice this. Jurassic World toys, 30% off, go get them. Um, we got a Diplodocus, that's kind of cool. Reminds me of that uh, initial merge for that very first movie. And speaking of, we still have some um, classic 93. And that those miniature packs, pretty cool. Uh, Hammond Collection, all right. Got Ganatosaurus. So I guess the, the Hammond Collection is still going on. Kind of cool. All right, Team NT also going on sale, so check out your targets guys uh we still have some godzilla and kong hey we got baby kong we got some tmnt's um stuff hmm have we seen this eel before i don't know it comes with a turtle head i don't know what's going on there um revolution for motu we got hordak we got battle armor he-man it looks like leech back there mm, that's gonna be it oh no we do have Sky, oh, almost dropped it. Skyclone in the house as well, and that beautiful box for the pizza thrower. TMNT again, just stuff that we have seen before. Now uh, let's jump into wrestling. It seems like the wrestling section is shrinking and shrinking by the minute. Um, we got wannabe country star right there. We got Special Olympics gold medalist. Ooh, now that. That's a look. That is a look. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be like ash or chest hair. You guys let me know down in the comments. All right, after that, we do have uh, some cars, which I know nothing about. And I think that is gonna do it in this side of the aisle. Okay, coming up to the next aisle over, we have some Sonic 3 multi-packs right there. Still got that Bowser from the movie, kind of nuts. Um, some more Sonic the Hedgehog stuff along with Sonic 3. Kind of want to see that movie now. Uh, we do have some more Mario, of course, both from the based on the game and based off of the movie. We got some Minecraft. Uh, we have some Adopt Me's, mm, some Rainbow Friends, and a bunch of. Um, oh, we do have some Pokemon. I was wondering about that. Kind of seen Pokemon in a little bit. Uh, some Mr. B stuff, and I think that's about it. We got some blocks and some holiday stuff. Okay, coming into the Funko NECA section. Let's jump right in here. With the Funko, we do have these Target exclusive BD Pops. Tempting, very tempting. Um, that Dead Star Collector finally making its way out in force, which we already got it, of course. Actually, I actually need to open that and just display it. Um, it looks like some holiday stuff from Marvel. We got an Iron Man Mark One, some funky colors on it. All right. Um, of course, now we keep finding this all over. So the Star Wars Millennium Falcon Bitty Pop, which I had been looking for. Um, but again, we already got that one. Let's see, we got some Street Sharks. 
and a whole bunch of other Funkos that I don't really know anything about. So check them out. Let me know if there's anything cool in this pile. Just noticed this Fisher Price Transformers. Oh my lord, that's so cute. That is super, super cute. I might have to get another baby even just for that. JK can afford it. All right, so down here we got some comic book uh, Funkos along with Krusty, talking doll. Some more Bitty Pops. Luckily, no new Star Wars, as far as I can see. Because, um, yeah, I've been buying these quite a bit. I think we're good on all those. Uh, moving on to the NECA section. We got some anime figs, such as Demon Slayer, Dragon Ball, Naruto, of course. Mm, let's see, we got some models. I feel like we haven't seen Gundam models in a little bit. And we got, let's see, let's jump in here. We got some Godzilla. So we've been getting a lot of new new merch for Godzilla. Check that out. Bandai, very, very nice. We got some more Gundam. Oh, that's the dead side from the movie, I think. It's pretty cool. We got the Godzilla 2004 back there. It looks like we got some more models. We got another classic Godzilla. We got some McFarlane animated Batman in the house. What is this? sort of Godzilla egg. We got some best action, we got some Toonie Terrors, Dungeons and Dragons on card. Always good to see, love those cards. Down here we still got a Chun-Li, we got another Doc, we got Vincent Price from Toonie Terrors, we got Ursin Crair, we got Last Ronin, and we got, whoa, what is this? We got Crying Hoon. And we got a Triceraton Gladiator, this thing is beefy. All right, uh, down here looks like we got some Broadway, mm, some One Piece, some Voltron, and most uh, phone right there. All right, we got a big head from Five Nights at Freddy's too. Okay, I think that's about gonna do it for this section. Okay, and we still got this um, Star Wars Lego in the middle of the aisle. Again, kind of cool to see all of this, you know, being displayed and. I haven't shown Legos in a little while, so I just wanted to stop by here. We do have some pretty cool stuff, of course, for Star Wars. Guardship, Coruscant Guardship, very nice. We got that TIE Bomber, of course, all of those helmets. Kind of wish they would have continued with that one. This very cool Droidica, of course. And then we got that beauty, the Rebuild the Galaxy Dark Falcon with our Darth Jar Jar, of course. So pretty cool stuff. We got a C-3PO up there, too. Uh, we got Sarlacc Pit, we got some of those um, smaller figs, or smaller uh, sets, I should say. Like that hallway scene, of course. And of course, a cool 10 to 5. We got Ahmed Best doing his thing as a Jedi Master right there. We got some Mandos and some clones. Always, always welcome to see. All right, Star Wars section, let's check it out. Micro Gals is going through. we got a bunch of N1s. Oh, we got Sheen Batty in the house. Black Series, gonna put them up there. We do have that Phantom. That's actually pretty cool. But I want that. Uh, I want that Amazon exclusive multi pack. So um, Hot Wheels in the house now. I'm definitely not picking these guys up anymore in regular stores since they have been showing up at Ross, as you just saw previously. All right. So Epic Heroes, not a whole lot either. Black Series. Mm do got that dark mall wonder if it's on sale what's on sale this one doesn't say this one says oh this is the mandalorian privateer i wonder if that's here i wouldn't mind picking that up for cheaper we got vader up there we got shinbadi hondo i'm sorry mando leia we got the shriek hawk i don't know if this one's gonna be on sale or not let's see there's also this multi-pack for droids maybe we check that out that might be on sale too um some more micro gas squadron we got the carbonized stuff here that cool matt fang fighter from mandalorians already got that one though um down here that beautiful t6 from ahsoka it's become one of the most popular ships i think uh, for this line this very awesome pod racers from boon to eve episode one again exclusive to target not my cup of tea, but I kind of love that they exist, to be honest with you. 
Oh, we got those extending lightsabers over there. Some non-extending ones. Um, we got that new U-wing as well right there again. Oh, don't do that, people. That's not nice. Uh, but yeah, we're going to price check this guy and see how it goes. But I think that's about it on this side. Oh, we still got that Halloween uh, lot cat. All right. So, yeah, that's going to do it for this side. Okay, so here we are checking the uh, Shrek Hawk, still a regular price, so I think it's going to be a pass for now. I do like it, but I was kind of hoping for a little bit cheaper than that. Oh well, on to the next one. Die cast section. Um, let's see what we got. What are these? I don't know. Doesn't look very aerodynamic. Uh, we got some multi-packs, of course. Mm, we got some tracks. Got um, what is this? Like a bus? It's kind of cool. All right, we got some bigger um, Hot Wheels in the house. We got some Fast and Furious stuff. Oh, that's nice. I do like that. Wow, Bentley. And of course, we got this cool uh, Toyota Cruiser. We got some uh, James Bond as well. Mm, looks like some double packs. Some of those bigger cars too. I don't know about 25 bucks even 18 bucks seems like a little bit high uh, we got some simpsons in the house we got some mario kart we do have some batman racers uh let's see what else do we got i don't know we still got some mario kart we still got some racer verse we got some tmnt stuff very little matchbox what's going on with matchbox are they in trouble um we do have a lot of jada as you can see some iconic scenes from Fast and Furious. Um, but yeah, that's about it, I think. We do have some Hot Wheels skates, some tech decks, some monster trunks. Monster trucks have been moved all the way to the end for some reason now, because they're just not popular enough. Okay, that's it. Hey, the Troopers, so we're gonna hit another Ross since we had uh, such a good run on the other one. Uh, we were just at Target here nearby and it went pretty good. So we're gonna check it out. Let's see what they find. Okay, so as we're coming into this Ross, uh, we do have a smaller, but still some toy section here. Let's go into the back. Okay, so this Ross also has a toy section. As you can see, very much expanded. So we're gonna go in here and it looks like we can. We got some uh, Cowboys merch right there. Got some Funko, we got some Dim um, Remember, we got some anime stuff here. Let's see. Jumping over to this side. Um, we got some play sets. Mm, nothing that catches. Oh, we do have a stunt squad pack right there. Let's see what we got down here. We got some bicycles. We got that cool real hero pack. I would have loved that as a kid. Um, some more Disney toys. Looks like some Barbies. Some cards here and some rc stuff over here we got some tanjiro statue not too bad for 10 bucks it's pretty good um out here we got some scooters uh looks like we got some legos we got marvel yep all right 20 bucks i don't know that that's exactly cheap we do have quite a bit of x shot here up in the front and over here let's see got some dinos we got some more street fighter cars and we do have a hot wheels snow speeder come in all right some more rc stuff and that's gonna be it pretty light on the action figures on this side at least ah uh, see this is the toy section i know and love look at this beautiful mess right there all right let's just jump right into it uh, let's see, coming over to this side, we got some Microgalaxy Squadron. We do have some more Hot Wheels. We got some Sonic, some Byakugan, Mario, Power Rangers back there. More for us about Minecraft. Some more Byakugan out here. Let's see, we got some Bebop. 10 bucks. More Microgalaxy Squadron, some Marble Racers. We got that Casey Jones, XN. Uh, we got Griff Karga. RIP to the great car weathers. Uh, let's see, we got some Pokemon. A little bit of Pokemon for six bucks. Some Spidey. Some more Ventress. Looks like a TIE Fighter back there. Page Puncher. Some basic figs for G.I. Joe. Quite a bit of them. Uh, 
Uh, we got some retro Phoenix shant down there. It looks like another a such Ventress, some Pokemon. Mm, let's see what do we got. What do we got? Some young Jedi adventures. Again, those are gonna basically pick warm. A little bit more Pokemon. We got a Raph from Best Action Figures. Uh, we got a Palpatine from the Retro. Uh, let's see what else do we got. We got some Naruto over here. We got some Jumanji. Some Jack Black in the house. We got again some more Marvel Legos. We have that N1. Mm, we got some Digimon. Some Pokemon. Some transformer tracks over there as well. Let's see what else. We got a uh, jailbreak. I don't know what that is. Oh, some DC. Finally, we got a Joker. This looks good. Not too bad. Not too bad for uh, six bucks, definitely. Some TMNT. We got some Disney Legos as well. Some more Marvel Legos. Some Sonic. Let's see. We go deeper. Not a whole lot there. Um. Ah, we got some Boca Tan, five bucks with the dark saber. It's not too bad, not too bad. Sonic statue, some more Naruto, some more Page Punchers and DBC down there. We got some more Hot Wheels right here. We got a snow speeder. We got another sand crawler. As I mentioned, I knew we were gonna find that one. Uh, we got a little bit of Avatar. We got a little bit more of uh, Micro Galaxy Squadron. We got some Acolyte lightsaber for 15 bucks. That's probably gonna stay here. Uh, let's see. I don't really see much. We got some more anime statues from Demon Slayer, Jujutsu Kaisen. We got a uh, Mysterio Funko Amazon exclusive, or it used to be. Um, up here, let's see. Oh, we got a T6. That's kind of cool. That's from uh, so ten bucks. That's not too bad. That's from Mission oh. Fleet. We got plenty more Hot Wheels again. Sand Crawler, Snow Speeder. Let's see the N1. We got some Nerf. We got some Stunt Squad. Mm, let's see. We got some more Boca Tents right there. I'm trying to see if we got anything different plenty of troop transports the urban legends casey jones 10 bucks again correct me if i'm wrong but i thought that one was uh, an exclusive um a lot more troop transports over here some naruto more casey jones and uh, this guy is another raf all right um oh plenty more casey jones Casey Jones galore over here. Uh, some little bit of Transformers. Some more Hot Wheels. Some more Disney Legos. Some Avatar. I don't think I've seen that one here. Plenty of Naruto. Plenty of Hot Wheels. Um, let's see. Got a little bit more Pokemon down there. And yeah, so I think that's that's gonna do it here. So I just noticed this pack here. What is this? Oh, that's the raft with the bike. That's kind of cool. 15 bucks. It's not bad. Look at all the accessories. Hmm. Got effect. That paint on the bike looks really good. Huh. I don't even think I saw this in stores normally. Let me know in the comments. Was this, um, was this a wide release? I really don't remember seeing this. Uh, vehicles from Best Action. I don't think I've seen all right, let me know again if uh, that's a good pickup for 15 bucks. Well, our troopers coming in back into the bunker with the pickups. Of course, we had to grab this guy. Ross coming in for the win, obviously. Um, it was very cool that I actually called this out not even a week ago when we were doing hunting at Target. We saw this guy too for regular price, which is about 15 bucks. But today we found it for a cool six bucks it's kind of crazy how ross is getting these so fast but i'm glad that i waited uh so yeah make sure to check out your ross next up something not star wars related but still pretty cool which is the redeemer from spawn so this is a mcfarlane uh figure as you can see we picked this up for five bucks i couldn't pass this up 
we are going to be opening this so we'll do a quick review on it here on the channel but this is one of my favorite characters from spawn so for five bucks i couldn't pass this up the box actually is in really good shape so if you wanted to leave it you know in box you definitely could uh but yeah once again ross coming in as the mvp this holiday season for toy hunting look at that illustration that's actually pretty so cool make sure that you are checking your rust as soon and as often as you can there's plenty of good deals to be had already the holiday season is in full swing so that is going to do it troopers thank you so much for joining me on this hunt leave me down in the comments if i missed something cool that was at a good price at ross uh target also had a ton of stuff and we're starting to see some deals obviously they're trying to clear some of the stock for the holiday season but ross is definitely the mvp this time around thanks again for watching please don't forget to leave us your like on this video subscribe if you haven't thank you so much if you already have and stay tuned for plenty more toy hunts here on the channel thanks again and i'll catch you on the next one